All right, everybody, we are back again with another part of Bramble. She's looking spicy, she's looking good, and let's go. Let's jump in. in the world boy is about to get done did it done diddly done jack reminds me of, like jack and the jack the giant slayer loki oh we're playing as the sister now no no okay. i thought we were playing as both What in the world? Turn to stone? What the hell? I'm guessing that's something to do with the like white light there. Ule was comforted by the morning sun. He had survived the night. But just barely. Yo. At least he had found the oh, stone God. again. That's a and wild. it felt like it was his sister's way of telling him he was on the right path. I want to know what that light is then. It would turn into stone then. That's kind of crazy. I'm not gonna lie, I I I, I would have pissed my fucking pants that happened to me. Can I go way out here? I think this is the furthest out I can go, yeah. Okay. Jeez, dude, even regular deer are like giants. The deer actually look bigger than that that troll that we found, so maybe trolls aren't at all actually that big. They're just big because we're so tiny. I think maybe those, I swear those deers over there are bigger than that troll. So I don't think a troll is actually like. Well, clearly it's not person sized. It'd be way bigger if it was person sized. And some small birds look giant, man. Oh, what's that down there? The little porcupine. Alright, let's see here. Ooh, hey, little porcupine. Aw, oh, oh. I mean, hedgehog. That's not a porcupine. That's a hedgehog. Is it? Yeah, no, that's a hedgehog. Not a porcupine, right? Man, y'all know what I mean, bro. Oh, is this the, the guy, the little hedgehog? Aww. Yeah, I th I'm pretty sure that's a hedgehog. They look similar. Though, right? That's cute. I guess the gnome put that on the back. I guess that's usually what they ride. Thank you, little hedgehog. There we are out. Man, imagine sprinting and knowing you're not going anywhere, bro. <laughs> For being a human and going so far to this. Oh, 
Oh. The salmon. I just walked that time. Um. What in the world are these things? Hey, what's up, man? around hello oh, no okay that's something um. what's those things again You have to go under here. What are those things, man? I'm trying to figure them out. They look like babies, but like piggies too. They're like baby piggies, the legs. I don't know what those things are. Man. I know these. Are, this is a gnome on my head. Little golem trolls. I, I don't know what those are. I am just being dumb. I, I really don't know what those things are. Fair? No, those aren't fair, fairies, bro. What the hell? Oh, it's the golem dude. Cool. Hey, got an achievement for golem boy. That's a giant axe, little stone axe there. Me misses his name. Wait, is that it here? No. Oh. I don't think that's what's up there. Um. I come here. Nope. There we go. Alrighty. Put a little gnome on top of my head. I thought I could just walk across that here small enough. <laughs> no. Yeah, those are definitely baby gnomes. Baby gnomes. What in the world? The light! What in the world was... It's Peter the Piper from Shrek. That's what it was.
Bro, he just went from light and sweet to... Wait, there's something walking around in here? I hear it. I hear the footsteps. Oh, please, for the love of God, please don't be anything walking in here. Am I supposed to jump on that? I feel like I am, but at the same time... That should terrify me. What the fudge is that noise? What the fuck is that, dude? Oh! Yeah, I saw that coming. I made that. Come on, game. I made that one. Oh! Bro, it started with me walking. It's so dark without this that I couldn't even tell I was already walking, man. Come on. Okay, Drop down, man. Jump. Walk on this beam. Bro, I'd be terrified, bro. I'm not gonna hold you. Yeah, I'd be terrified. I'm way older than this kid. This dude's a trooper. Like, I'd be terrified, bro. Like, he's just marching through it. Like, how old is this kid? Like, 12? 12! Doing this. What the fuck was that? Nope, nope, I'm out. Nope, nope. Mm -mm. The fact that I even gotta ask that is enough for me to get up out of here. Nope. It's time to go. It's time to go. It's time to go. I do that noise. This is horrifying. Okay. It launched me so far. Y'all are seeing this, right? Hold on, let me... Hold on, man. I gotta adjust the light in this room, bro. Because I can't see for jack how dark it is. Let me see. Let me just, just give me a minute, y'all. So I can see the screen better. There we go. I can see way more now. Okay. under a tree anyway, man. Uh, that noise. I'm wearing headphones too, man, so I'm just hearing it all. It's, uh, it's disturbing, man. Uh. What is that thing? What the hell? Is. It looks so far and deep. The funny part is it probably isn't either. All right, let's get out of here, man. This this is this is a highly uncomfortable place. 
Ugh, it's disturbing. What the hell? Um, I don't know how to feel about that. Okay. So like some demon or something pushed people or something like that? It looks like. Oh, it ate the people? It's eating them or what's I'm trying to hmm, okay. Push them underground or something. I don't know man, those symbols can be taken so many different ways. Maybe I'm just being down and not too smart. Oh you're out of the cave now. Oh god, nope. It's the Piper again. Oh boy. What the hell is that? During the day? Oh shit. Run! God. Why does it look like the day's ending already? Ain't no way. Ain't no way the day's almost over already. Get out of here. Cat. Ugh. The mud is deep, man. Ugh. Oh, there goes another troll that's in stone. Ugh, that's gross. I don't know, man. What y'all think? Would y'all be able to do this even for your sister? Like... I don't know, man. It's my sister, bro. I, I couldn't just leave my sister. Ah, oh, nah. Oh. No, we out. We out. We out. We gas. We gas. Look at this man. He said, "Yo, dodge me, boy." This game does not hold back when it comes to just the violence, man. Poof. Jesus. Jesus, what is he doing to like have it be that damn loud? Like, I know y'all don't got headphones in, but if we do, that shit's powerful. Oh! Uh, I'm sorry. I don't know what I was thinking. I wasn't paying attention. I'm so sorry. Alright, we need to get up out of here. Oh, I got lucky. No more? Okay. Yo, that is wild. 
But like a... Oh, shit! I hit so damn quick, bro. Back in the water? It's nice out now. You gotta be kidding me. Bro. Just those things. I don't know what those are. I don't know what those are supposed to be. That ain't no <laughs> troll. That ain't no golem. Giant. I don't know what those were. This makes me want to research up more on my freaking fables now, dog. Understand what the hell those are, but the hell is this? That was a good sequence though. I, I really enjoyed that sequence. That was just Oh boy. In his past life, Nakin was a simple man that loved playing his violin. But the village did not appreciate his talent. People would frequently bully him, and the only soul that did not was a girl that Nakin fell in love with. One day, the bullying and beatings became so severe that Nakin's anger finally overtook him. He marched into the village, playing forbidden melodies that made everyone dance until their flesh and bone got worn down. Jesus. They eventually died leaving behind shuffling corpses, still trying to dance to Nekin's melodies. His love was not spared death either. Devastated, Nekin left the town and lived by the lake drowning in his sorrow, where he still lures people with his deadly music. So that's what that was? How is that dude turn? Ah, Jesus. It's crazy, dude. It's an eerie story, too simple, but it works. See, this is why you don't have to overcomplicate everything, you know what I mean? Like, you keep stuff simple in storytelling, it can still be just as powerful and impactful. Just like those melodies were hitting, bro. <laughs> Damn. They are hitting all right, too. That was a really good sequence. I think that has been my favorite so far. I can already tell this game is going to be good, bro. And hella fucked up. I'll put in my hearing. I'm hearing something on my headphones. Something to the right. Day? Daytime? Oh, shit. I thought it was night. Maybe it's because the cable is just like. Oh, no. came out the waterfall that was sick just where are you going boy yo this game is lit you're alive holy shit whoops oh he got fucked up damn back broken like bang you know what I'm saying survived against Nakin Nakin was sick that was a sick sequence bro hey yo I like this the rain and everything I feel it bro yeah, let's 
kind of peaceful right here. I just lie there enjoying the rain for a bit, man. After everything this kid's been through. Damn. Alright, let's get up. That's a beautiful scene, though. Come on, get up, kid. You're probably hurting like a motherfucker, too. I'm surprised he survived. Oh, wow. That's the little part. Is Nakin even alive? I mean, dead? Not bad. I mean, he looked dead, but let's be honest. In this forest, bro, <laughs> in this forest, bro, who knows? I have my doubts. He might still be alive. Kids gone through it, bro. Kids gone through it, man. All oh, to get his sister back. Oh, another dream. Oh, it's black and white now. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, it's just to get his sister. You know, I'm gonna predict, bro. How fucked would it be if she's dead already? Like, I'm just saying, like, we go through all this, all this torture, probably kill a, a creature or two on our way. We get to where she is, and she's already dead, bro. I'm predicting it. I'm predicting she's going to be dead by the end of the game. They've been all for nothing. This this strikes me, this story right here strikes me as a, a tale of, of sorrow. There is no winning in this, you know what I mean? So I have a feeling she's going to be dead. That's my prediction here. Y'all remember my last prediction. Y'all remember my Star Wars prediction, though. That was that was pretty that was pretty obvious, my Star Wars prediction. But you know what I mean? I still made it. You know what I mean? Anybody doubt me, giving me clowns, and now it's right. So we'll see. We'll see with this game. I'm 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 calling it. The sister's gonna be dead by the end of the game. Either either she's going to die or she already is. As the rebel crawled closer and closer. The darkness took hold of his heart and filled it with fear. I don't think I can stop this, right? Then there was a light. The sister? This is his sister. What? Oh man. Don't leave me on a cliffhanger. I want to say it was his sister. That's not his sister. What the hell? Is that the girl from the fable? The book? Hey, yo, our dude look. Oli. Oli looks fucked up. Hey, yo, man, going in for the lap pillow. I feel like that's the girl from the book, right? No, she had brown hair? Or was it blonde? I can't remember what she looked like from the book. Is that her? I'm gonna have to go back in my video and check. Plot twist. She's actually the second protagonist of the game. The sister's dead. <laughs> Alright, I'll stop. I'll stop. Oh yeah, what's going on here? Of she being human, though. Oh, he's, he's better. He's a cleaner. light in the darkness. Then again, I, mean, I guess it was right. She had Tuva. filled his That's heart her name. with courage 
and the stone with her radiance. The bramble covers all where darkness has taken hold, Tuva said. The bramble. That's Follow the light. Phone. You will find what you are searching for within the mountain. She's staying there? Well, Tuva is her name, huh? And this place is called the Bramble. A little fable land is Bramble. And Bramble's kind of fucked up, dog. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> Bramble's kind of, kind of fucked up, land. <laughs> but I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, uh, is it getting lighter or is it getting darker? Now we gotta deal with that stuff. That's gonna be nice. Can't wait to have to deal with that later on. I think it's getting darker. Whatever it is, can't deal with it yet. This way? Ah. So you have to go where the white flowers are. Ah, mm. the sound! I wish I could hear the sounds. I think I just cut myself. I wish I could hear the nasty sounds that's playing every time one of them vines move, man. It's all nasty. It's like, like ugh. Ah. Gross. Whoa. Oh, hey. Yeah, he's big. I mean, I knew he was big, but like, damn. To really tell the size of him from a distance like this. Ooh. Okay. I don't know what that does. I don't think I want to know what that does.
that flower thing is uh, creepy. I don't like it. The land was once a peaceful the kingdom hell? with a great king. Now, Yo. his image embodied the darkness that had drowned the world in bramble. This must be a whole new realm, man. This can't be like a something going on on Earth. They gotta teleport to a whole new realm or something, bro. Ain't no way. No, it had to be Earth. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Run, kid, run! Game is good. Simple but good, man. Simple but excellent. Simple but great. Awesome. Alright, everybody. We're gonna go ahead and end the episode off here. Thank you for joining me for Lamus another part. Would always look after his only friend. But um we will um be streaming again soon after this, so we'll we'll be getting it going, you know what I'm saying? Getting it going. <laughs> But uh, yeah, thank you all for coming. And uh, Bramble's been great, man. Bramble's been, Bramble's been going, man. 